in reality, for everyone that works in innovation, failure is just part of your day job, really. So validation is great, but invalidation is also great because it saves you a load of time and money sort of spent building the wrong thing that nobody wants, right? In risk management, you want to eliminate failure. In innovation, you actually want to promote failure. You want to learn fast and kind of learn from your failures. And if you're not failing enough, or you're not failing, you're actually not being innovative. And then once you have a successful, minimal viable product, you can keep on growing the baby. And then everybody will have a shared success story. But you need to focus on communication and to be aware what your silos are able to digest. Think about how we can uh, bring the right people, the diversity, you know, the different mindsets. Uh, and also when you talk about people. So how you can bring people, process and technology together. You need a sense of urgency which also makes them rethink how they work today and how they might work better tomorrow.